Welcome to our weekly intentions, where we take one word or one phrase every week, and we take that word and phrase with a specific goal in mind and apply it on our mat and off our mat to our daily lives. Enjoy the journey. Hello. So today we are going to talk about flow state. And this is a term that is starting to gain a lot of traction, right? Uh, that optimum flow state, how do people mentally shift to a frequency where they're operating at their best, right? Where there's just a nice, easy flow. Um, that sounds fantastic in theory. Uh, the work that has to go behind creating that flow state is where the gold and the magic is. That's what we do at Zen 57. We physically take our body on in a way where we in turn mentally strengthen our spirit to a whole different level and that's really what flow state is for us here and the next 12 days we're doing our flow state for the 12 days really getting our minds to understand how to strengthen itself enhance itself become more confident it's done through a daily physical practice, a non-negotiable of stimulating those neurons, creating these different neural networks physically so you can mentally get into a space where you're confident, your self-image is better, you're just much more focused and sharp, your energy is up, you're secreting certain hormones because of the way you're training, because of the way you're eating, you're stimulating certain neurons because of the way you're training, because of the way you're eating. All of that added into the pot starts to stimulate this response, this connectivity on a daily basis between you and that higher self through the spine, through the vagus nerve, through all the cranial sacral nerves. That's the flow state that we talk about in Zen 57. That's the journey that it involves. That's the mindset it gives you. That's the physiology behind the mindset. It's not theoretical, it's experiential. You're not going to think about getting into a state of Zen, you can't. You're not going to just sit quietly and meditate, you can't. You're not wired that way. You have to take the time, you have to understand how to awaken things one by one, stimulate different neurons, understand how to send signals through a correct pattern where anatomically your body learns to wake up a certain way. Over a period of time, those neural networks that you're creating will strengthen so much and from a preventative care standpoint, there's nothing you can do better for your body than that. Until next time, fist to palm, take a bow. Thank you for watching that video. If you enjoyed this type of content, please be sure to hit subscribe and like, and stay tuned in for all of our weekly content, including live weekly classes that we will be uploading for you. Fist to palm, take a bow.